Colby Covington maintain status as one of the best welterweights in the world. He is absolutely one of the best welterweights in the world. And a lot of times people mistake the talk and the persona for Colby not being able to be a fighter. Colby Covington is a fantastic fighter, and he will get in your face from the moment the official or the moment the referee says fight, and the pace, and the cardio, and the work rate that he will push on his opponents is enough to break guys. Guys that are traditionally known as phenomenal cardio fighters like Rafael Dos Anjos melt under Colby Covington. He is a great fighter and a very, very hard worker. Well, this is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. So these fighters relatively close in age, just a year apart, with some differences in height, but the same reach. Now to get us started, the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 16 wins, three losses. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Kobe Chaos coming time! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make it official. They touch him up, and we are underway. Ready. All right, so here we go. Round one is underway. Very compelling matchup for fight fans around the world. It's going to be very interesting to see how soon the grappler goes for the takedown. Well, he's going to try to get the takedown right away. But when he shoots that shot, when he changes that level, he is going to be shooting into a guy that truly understands all aspects of mixed martial arts. I'm wondering how, if his first shot doesn't work, does he approach who's trying to get this fight to the Really timing his shots nicely, good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Ooh, blocks the shot. Big call for punch land. Now he gets back to range. Unable to connect with the ring. Another straight left. Look at the angle of that nice body kick. 
All right, so one minute into the fight, we've got a full-on brawl here, DC. It's great for the fans, not necessarily for the gas tank if this thing goes much longer. Not great for the gas tank and not good for the old noggin. You can't ah. take so many upside the head, somebody's going to sleep. Oh, that's a nice strike. Oh, that's a nice jab from Colby Covington. You know, it's amazing to think not all that long ago people didn't fancy him a striker. Now, looks like a fighter who can truly do it all. He stood 24 minutes with Kamara Usman. No takedown attempts, no wrestling. Stood right in the pocket and had a lot of success in that fight against the welterweight champion. So just over 20 total strikes and counting have now landed for Colby Covington. Nice jab by Lee. Just over three minutes to go, round one. Well, a lot of people think he might have the best jab in this division, certainly using it effectively. I mean, one of the best jabs in the world across all combat sports. The way that it just comes out, it's beautiful. The backside hand is always at the chin. The elbows tucked to the ribs. The jab goes out, the jab comes right back to the face. It's picture-perfect technique, almost like a Tybo class or something like that. Punch over the top. Back and forth we go here. Yeah, he's mixed it all up. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Punch coming, it's blocked. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, nice combination of strikes there in terms of the accuracy. I mean, that's exactly what a coach is looking for. That's exactly. It's like the guy is hitting pads. It's like he's hitting focus mitts. But instead, he's dancing all over his opponent's face. Beautiful punch. Spinning back fist is there. Covington's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, how about the head movement? Slips his head off the center line and then rips back. I mean, he's cutting him down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Nice counter jab up top by Covington. Oh, he lands another strike to the body. Really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Covington gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Gotta find a way to move those feet. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Covington's punch to the body is blocked, so no damage done there. Nice kick. He's got to go there. Kick to the body is there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. 30 seconds now to go in round one. Oh, he's got it going now. Nice connection there, DC. Another punch land. All right, 20 seconds to go in the round. Oh, flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Horn sounds for the end of round one. Stop, stop, stop. Right, well, his kicking game was outstanding in that round. We'll see if his opponent can make the adjustments, but take us through the replays before we get there. It's always weird to watch a young fighter start to come into his own. Early in his career, he did not have this ability. He did not have the ability to dictate and control fights with his legs. Now he does, and he looks like a future champion in the making. All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets under. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Oh, big punch land. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. 
His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. But that punch, no good. He blocks the punch. Oh, he gets tagged. Nice combination there, and might not be a bad idea for the opposition to just tweak that head off yeah. the center. He was landing one before. Now he's doing everything in combination, and they're all landing. Man, striking class is in session. Beautiful punch there. Great job landing. What a damaging punch. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Beautiful body kick. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Covington. All right, so he continues to land that patented jab and keeping his opponent at bay. You can know that it's coming, but until you're in there with him, the speed and the power of that jab is something you can't really prepare for. Nice connection with a the punch there. It's hard to recall time in the past that his boxing looked this sharp. He's never looked this good. And both guys really throwing with authority. Shot to the body here, blocked by Covington. Right hand on point. Oh, big head kick. Nice combination of kicks there by Lee. Throwing that jab, no good. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do with it. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate. A lot of activity in the hands. Looks phenomenal tonight. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that punch. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Lee. Covington's torso, specifically that right side, has absorbed a lot of damage tonight. And here comes the purple, the black, and blue. A definite blue starting to form on that right side. Well placed kick there by Lee. Punches block. He's throwing every part of himself into his big leg kick. Oh, strong punch there by Covington. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Nice body kick. Oh, he's got that knee to connect to the body, and if you're the defensive fighter here, you got to make sure you don't eat too many more of those. Cannot eat you got to get the elbows inside. Otherwise, you're going to land one that's going to shut everything down. Oh, man. How many head kicks can one man absorb before getting separated from his conscience? One, normally. <laughs> this guy has a great chin, but if he takes any more, he's going to be sleeping. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. Nice one, two there. Oh, huge block! Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. He has landed a high volume of strikes in this round. It really hasn't let up when it comes to his aggressiveness. The striking has been on point every step of the way. Careful to not gas out, but you gotta like the output here down the stretch. He's able to slip the left there. Effective punch there by Lee. Just missed with the left there. He's very tricky when he throws that body kick. With a right. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard and prevent any damage. Those hands never leave where they're supposed to be. And if you do that, most times you will block the shot that's incoming. All right, a lot of high level highlights from that last round, DC. Take us through the replay. If he fought like this, I would be comfortable entering him into a K1 level right? kickboxing competition. He's that good at finding and landing those kicks at will. He needs to continue to do this as the fight goes on.
All right, here we go as our next round gets underway. His strong leg packs so much power that even when he doesn't go with full throttle, you see he's able to inflict damage. We'll see if he can keep it going here in this He round. doesn't throw it full power, but even when he faints it, he draws out reactions from his opponents because they don't want to get hit with any more of those kicks. It's a sight to behold. Oh, big flying knee finds the target. Now we'll see if the longer, taller fighter can move in and follow it up. Oh, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Oh, head kick attempt. It is blocked by Covington. Oh, nice connection by him there with the right hand. The right hand is the dominant hand, and you can see how well he throws it. Oh, nice, nice right hand. Oh, how good is that jab by Covington? Right hand upstairs. So he lands another jab here. Nicely done there by Lee. Big kick lands. That right hand hurt him a little bit. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proving prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? They continue to exchange. Oh, big left hand there. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. Nice straight punch. Well, if you're going to leave your body that wide open, you're going to pay the price, and he certainly did there as his opponent lands flush to the midsection. Trying to double up on that jab. Oh, pretty good handiwork on the feet there from Colby Covington. Doesn't get enough credit for the striking, but it's certainly on point tonight, champ. Lee going for the head kick. No dice. Nice counter shot there. Big kick. Some fighters shy away from checking a leg kick. Check that one. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Nice loose punch. Oh, and he lands another punch there, and you can tell at this point he is going right at that cut on his opponent. Right at the cut on the eye, just making sure he knows that I'm going to be targeting it. Keep your hands up, and when the hands go up, he will then change the target down low, trying to find finish. Nice jab, follows up with a nice right hand. There's no tell on that leg kick. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Effective punch there by Covington. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Not there. Covington's lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Right hand upstairs. Coming to this strike attempt there is blocked. That was a thudding leg kick. Plus right hand is true. Both fighters throwing heat now. And a nice jab there, champ. The jab was a lost art in mixed martial arts. Guys have found it, and they are fighting behind it real well. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Good punch. Looping left hand misses the target. Nice leg kick land. And that one certainly found the target. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Head kick. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he 
really is trying to get damage off every time he throws his punch. Nice punch lands over the top. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, the round is over. Gut check time for him now. You see the cut on his cheek has gotten really, really bad. And even though it's not affecting his vision, if it gets any worse, the doctor will be called in. And I can assure you, he's going to have no choice but to stop this fight. All right, next round is underway, and if you look at these two guys in between rounds, it looks like they've barely broken a sweat, both with good resting heart rate, stamina still very high, and you just have to laud the efforts of these guys in training. Both men certainly noted cardio specialists, but incredible that they would have this much in the tank after 10-plus minutes of fight. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Good punch land. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Ooh, head kick lands. Back and forth we go. through with a big knee. All right, so he continues to land that jab. His opponent said he was ready for it, but doesn't appear to be. You're not ready until you're in there. You can watch all the film you want. You can spar as much as you want, but until you feel a guy with a fast jab like this, you don't understand the precision of that punch. What a punch. Drive the shin into the opponent's body with that body shin. Hook shot attempt to the head here. Instead, it's blocked by Covington. Nice counter right hand lands for him. Oh, he landed that kick to the outside of the lead leg there, DC. He is chopping up that leg. They say chop down the tree. You beat your opponent by slowing him down first with those nice outside leg kicks. Oh, and he is getting tagged repeatedly. Nice combination of strikes up top. Oh, beautiful combination up top. I don't understand why the guy is not moving his head. Get your head moving, son. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Covington gets hit with a kick. You got to check these low leg kicks. Ooh, big shot lands. Oh, tagged him with that right hand. What a strike that was. What a strike that he is landing over and over again. His opponent will need to make some adjustments. Oh, that's a good right hand. Oh, that straight punch was useful, champ. Multiple times, he's used this punch to get to the target. Nice punch, man. Try to establish that jab. Ooh-wee! Ooh-wee, what a right hand by this young man. Hard shots landing on both sides here. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Would you look at the size of that bruise on his body? His opponent will likely continue to attack. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave a mark. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Big head kick land. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Right on the button. Watch these to the body. Nice strike. Still 
still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Beautiful right hook counter. Big body kick. Going out of the body with that hook. Well done there by Covington. Oh, beautifully placed in time kick there by Lee. Oh, that is a nice straight punch by him there. He's got it all going tonight. No wasted actions, no loopy punches. He's going right to the target. Oh, that's a good strike there by Covington. Huh. Huh. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays, DC. And if you like the kicking game, that was the round for you. Yeah, man, he used his kicks beautifully. He managed distance, managed space, and eventually those kicks started to really take an effect on his opponent and slow him down. He has to stay the course next round. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick, and watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Beautiful leg kick. Over. That one snuck in. Nice strike. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Good series of punches by him there. He has certainly had no trouble finding the range tonight. He is finding a target with everything he throws. He's mixing it up beautifully. Blocks the shot. Wow, that right punch has been the money weapon for him tonight, and he landed it again there. If his opponent does not change something, he will continue to throw the strike until he makes it. Stop throwing. Great punch landed with so much power. What a body kick. He lands flush with that right hand. Ooh, what a head kick. Just misses there with the left. Hand. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Lands the right hand. Unable to connect with the right hand there. Wow! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. Oh! Back to the feet. Over and over and over, he's landing these nasty body kicks. Under three minutes now to go in this one. Covington's overhand punch to the head doesn't get there blocked by the defense. Back to the well with that right hand, it's no good. Well placed kick there by Lee. Pretty good right hand. Gets lit up by that straight punch. Oh, and he lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Oh, beautifully placed with the left hook counter. Well, eventually you know he's going to turn this defense into offense, but he's certainly doing a nice job on the defensive end this They talk about the feeling out process. He's getting his opponent's timing. Now he's blocking everything. Expect counting as we go forward. Now connects with the right. Still nice body kick land. Ooh, what a punch. Almost in range with the straight left, but that's a miss. 90 seconds remain in the fight. There's no give on that leg kick. Oh, Chris boxing here. The right punch followed immediately up by a left. Right hand upstairs. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Oh, 
swing and a miss by Covington. Big leg kick lands. One minute to go in the fight. Wow. 45 seconds remain in the round. Real quick leg kick. Another leg kick land. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, effective strike there by Lee. Landed that left hook. Big head kick lands. Oh, nice jab to the head there by Covington. Oh, pinpoint knee to the body. If you're trying to knock me out, you can one knee to the body. I'm done. Every time in the corner tries to get close, he just drives that knee to the body. Great timing. Lunges forward with a left there. What else can you say but what a fight? All right, so as we await the judges' scorecards, DC will look back at his handiwork. He had it all going from a striking standpoint tonight. Man, he did a great job. It was very entertaining to watch someone be in such a great state of flow, a great flow state in regards to the stand-up. He said that tonight we would be very impressed with his performance, and I am thoroughly impressed. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 48-47. The winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, so there he is. The celebration is on. He tried to leave the judges out of it tonight, was unable to do that, but a pretty dominant effort nonetheless. He's your winner by unanimous decision. And you've got to feel good about that. You've got to feel good about dominating every aspect of a fight and getting a victory.